Members of the Movement for the Actualization of Sovereign State of Biafra and Security Operatives Clash in Enogon. The clash came when members of the group were trying to celebrate its 18th anniversary with a peaceful rally in Enogon, South East Nigeria. Correspondent Joseph Oliva has details in this report presented from our studios. Officers of the Nigerian police who arrived at the venue of the rally at about 9.30 a.m. with about 15 Hilux vehicles conveying armed police officers shot several tear gas canisters to disperse the agitators. According to some of the members of the group who spoke after the incident, their treatment by the police is barbaric and inhuman. We are a non-violent organization and they, they are suspicion, uh, yeah, they are pressing us to not to achieve our goal. But due to our chief, our chief have told us and taught to us that we should not do any violence, that this organization is no violent organization. So that is why we have been using that non-violent to move in anywhere that we are doing. Like this issue now that they are throwing their, uh, tear gas to us, we are just want to celebrate our nine, uh, 18 years advisory. Different advice to you. I was very surprised to see police still brutalizing and putting tear gas on our members. Since, they are, since we have started this struggle, there's nothing like violence. We don't participate in doing violence. Whatever. We are fighting our rights through normal channel. And with this morning, as we are going on our peaceful demonstration, we did not block road, we did not press anybody, and I will stop police all over the in the state, putting tear gas to scatter our movement. My experience just now, we have been seeing it. Look at the way Nigeria, we have been seeing the molestation, humiliation, in, that is in many forms. They have been suppressing us for we to give up, but no going back on the Biafra issue. Biafra is our right. We are anchor our movement into no violent organization. It's the suppressor that will be weak, not weak. So, as you can see, the way they have been shooting tear gas, arresting our people in any carry many of our people that collapse on the, on the floor. Some of them said there is no going back on the quest for the actualization of the sovereign state of Biafra. It's too, it's too much walking seriously. And no violence, non exodus. There is no any problem for this struggle. It was if the leaders quietly to channelize Biafra. There is no any problem on it. They called on the international community to intervene in order to stop the brutalization from the Nigerian security operatives. The group itself has been accused of several atrocities by residents of the southeast and does not enjoy popular support in the region.